Hello and namaste. My name is Brandon Foltz, and I teach statistics and other mathy things here on YouTube. If you like this video, please hit subscribe and ring that bell for more. In this problem walkthrough, we will continue reviewing linear equations to prepare you for linear regression. I know your time is valuable, so let's go ahead and get started. Aaron's Word Processing Service, AWPS, so this is Aaron over here on the left, by the way, does word processing. The rate for services is $32 per hour plus a $31.50 one-time charge. The total cost to a customer depends on the number of hours it takes to complete the job. Find the equation that expresses the total cost in terms of the number of hours required to complete the job. First thing I will say is that some of you may have encountered this in your day-to-day -day life, but this is actually how a lot of services work. So a little while back, I needed someone to come fix an appliance in my kitchen and they charged me a fee just to show up to my house. And then it was so much per hour after that. This is the same basic idea. So in his service, Aaron charges a $31 fee, $31.50 actually, just to basically show up. So if he agrees to the job, it's $31.50 just to start. So I'm going to put $31.50 up here at 12 o'clock. We'll assume that he's gonna start this job at 12. And then every hour after that, it's $32. So let's say this job takes one hour exactly. So that's $32 on top of the $31.50. Let's say it takes two hours. That's another $32 and so on and so forth. So what we have here is a regression model that says the cost is going to equal the 31.50 to start plus $32 per hour. And we'll say the hour is the X, that's the variable. So we can say Y equals 31.50 plus 32X. Now, of course, each job doesn't have to take an exact hour amount. It could be 1.5 hours or 2.3 hours, doesn't matter. This variable X here allows flexibility. So he could charge 31.50 plus 32 times, say, 2.4 hours to get his total. So here's the final equation that expresses the total cost in terms of the number of hours required to complete the job. Okay, so that wraps up this video. Before you go, please check out some of the other content I have here on my channel. That being said, I appreciate you spending some of your valuable time with me. I wish you all the best in your work and in your studies, and I look forward to seeing you again next time. Take care. Bye-bye.